Every day, birds and insects fly around us. But we often forget they spend much time in the atmosphere, at high altitudes, and during the night, in places and at times we cannot see. The GLOBAM project scientists developed an innovative method to study airspace, this important but often overlooked habitat for biodiversity. They used large networks of weather radars from Europe and the US to identify and measure the biological activities of birds and insects far into the atmosphere. They found out that up to 5 billion birds migrate at night over the US every year. To put this into perspective, it is as if two-thirds of humans were moving over an area under the cover of darkness. They also observed incredibly large movements of over 80 million birds and trillions of insects flying over Europe on some nights. That's more than a thousand times the number of people alive today. In an increasingly crowded airspace, full of buildings, aircrafts, light, noise and chemicals, understanding these movements becomes essential. To ensure safe air travel, we must know where and when birds are aloft. Besides, wind and other vital renewable energy sources can impact and be impacted by the presence of avifauna. Globam demonstrated that by developing models telling us where and when large numbers of birds occur, we could issue warnings to avoid human, wildlife and economic losses from collisions with them. We could reduce our impact on them, because despite birds and insects being a key part of global biodiversity, they keep on showing alarming declines all over the world. Globam also revealed that meteorological radars can do much more than monitor the weather. They can be our ever-present eyes as large-scale biodiversity monitoring system, which is an invaluable opportunity to study and deepen our knowledge of all life forms occupying the airspace.